What's cracking you guys? My name's Brody and yeah, so we're today we're here at Good Games Brisbane and we're gonna be hitting up the pre-release. Um, so yeah, I rocked up and so far there's there's really like no one here. But it should be good. Check out this, we got like the like alleyway kind of thing. But yeah, I'll see you guys in there. Alrighty guys, so this thing coming up, it um it's like the selection process of, so they called out the names and everyone kind of walked up and gra uh, randomly selected um, their six initial first six packs off the front counter and then we went off and opened up, but yeah, you guys will see that now. Todd M. He's coming as well. Gerardo. Hang on a second, we'll be up here. What's the deck building rules? Is So guys, we're here. We got the breakthrough packs. Check that. Marowak. Wait. What do you got? All the dog shit. My second pack's a dud. A dud signal. Alrighty. So let's get into these. Mega handy. Keen as. Oh, no, I'm the last one. And the brace. Brace. Alright. So it's Star Doo Duo. A Ghastly. Woobat. Slow Wobbly. The Floatstone. Mega Hound and Spirit Link. We got a Floet. A Reverse Duo. And a Hollow Octillery. So that's pretty sweet. So what we got? We got Hug. The attack hug. So what's that do? The defending Pokemon can't retreat during your opponent's next turn. You're awesome. Dude, that's sick. Oh, it's a judgment. I haven't got any of that. Alrighty. Next pack, pack number two, we got Meg Mewtwo Y. Oh, <laughs> Stores mascot. The Shroomish EX. The Shroom. <laughs> <laughs> this is shroomish, yes. The store's mascot. The store's mascot, so the shroomish EX. Alrighty, pack number two. We got Mistrevis, Swablu, a uh, Fly Baby, Axew, Scatterbug, Pilot Swine, a Floet, a uh, Burning Energy, a Chatot Reverse Rare, and a Sumisia Regular Rare. I'm not asking. Make me 2x. You had two at the end. So it's. So it's sort of you. I saw something good. Oh, wow. So we got Chessman, a Bronzor, Froki, Pampor, Cyndaquil, Earthring. You got the same as me. Fisherman, a Marowak Break. No, I'm you 2x. Oh. Wait, what's going on? Oh, I got a floor just break. Yeah, it's supposed to be like 12 of these suckers or what? Yeah, so that's pretty sweet. And a Cresselia. Yeah. Next. Zubat. Next. Zoro. No, no. Not yet. Oh, Oh, no, Galilee. Um. Okay, so we got Piplop, a Magmite, Noibat, Ralts, Skidoo, Spupa, a Brakesin, a Rainbow Energy, a Snorlax, is that one just, uh, yeah, that one's an uncommon, and a Aromatisse, any climactic. Alrighty, second last pack, we got Mega Houndoom. Ooh. Ooh, I think. I'm not sure. We'll see. We got Magnemite, a Ralt, Chespin, Noibat, Piplop, Stunfisk, a Bridget, 
Giovanni scheme, that's sweet. Ghastly reverse. And a Giovanni scheme full art. So that's pretty sweet. It's like themed, hey? So we got the regular Giovanni scheme and the full art. So that's awesome. And the last pack. We got Cyndaquil, Hippopotas, Cubone, Elgin, Pantsage, Magneton, Earthring, Stunfisk, a Floet Reverse, and a Typhlosion Hollow. Not bad. Break. Oh. Alright guys, and we're back. So we got the the breakthrough promo, the Chesnot. So what's that? Promo number 68. You guys pause and have a read of that if you'd like to see that. But anyway. We got the last two packs, the bonus packs. We're gonna open up the Zoroark first. Let's go. Let's go. Okay. <laughs> Dunno. Dunno. Let's knock this down a little bit. Alright, we got Vanillite, Pampor, a Rolls, a Zorua, a Meow, a Burning Energy, a Fracture, Heavy Boots, Chest Pin, and an Obama Snow. Last pack. Last pack, what can we get? I don't know, dude. I don't know. I'm feeling pretty negative. We got Skiddo, Star U, Paris, whoops. We got Do Duo, Refractual, Heavy Ball, Snorlax. A reverse Snorlax and a Staraptor. Uh, so that's right. But we did, we did manage to get these two today, so it's it's not bad. It's not bad. Alrighty, so we're leaving the pre-release. There's there's my car. Good games is up there. It was good fun, and I'll um I'll have a recap later on today. Now we're at uh, we're at Toys R Us. Oh, this is the prime section. It's all pink. Alrighty, guys, and we're back. So it's the end of the day. The pre-release has gone down, and um. Yeah, so I, I just want to speak about um, like how my day went and how things went down. Just do a bit of a recap video. Um, so down here on the main cam, we're gonna just go through bits and pieces here. So I, I kept the packs that I opened up. So we got the we got the Mega Mewtwo pack art. So it looks pretty pretty nice. So it's like all opened up. But yeah, what, so what's it say here? Let's have a look. So it says, Parallel Worlds to Past Power. An amazing discovery, Pokemon Break Evolutions open a new path to power that builds on a Pokemon's existing strengths and creates all new battling options. These new Pokemon Break 
come from Twin Worlds home to Zoroark Break, Mega Mewtwo X and Mega Mewtwo Y. One world of technology, one world of nature and all the wonders of Break Evolution are yours to explore in the Pokemon TCG XY Breakthrough Expansion. So yeah, it's got 160 cards, 162 cards, and two secret rares, so 164 total. All right, so we got we got Mewtwo. The Mewtwo pack art looks pretty spiffy. Then we got the Zoroark. Uh, that's the break art. Obviously, it's all it's all gold. It looks it looks pretty nice. And then we got the Houndoom, Mega Houndoom pack art, which looks pretty nice as well. And Mega Mewtwo Y, awesome. So they're all nice and um in line for me. But then also the other packs I opened up. I had another two Houndoom pack arts. Had that and had that. Cool. So that's that's the rubbish out of the way. That's enough admiring rubbish. But um, so throughout the day I had um, a very very interesting experience. So um, the judge that was there judging the pre-release, he actually hooked me up. He was like, "Hey, dude, um, do you want these?" He, the the guy that did the shroomish ex, he like shaked his hand in and it was like the streamer had 110 uh, damage on that tackle the store's mascot but yeah he he hooked me up with um, this league league promo melodic it's pretty nice it has like a, a, a very like liney hollow pattern with the pokeball symbol there that's how you can tell that it's the league promo and then he gave me a staff promo Kingdra which is awesome you can see it's a staff promo because it's got the little staff logo there but that's awesome um, cause I, I was telling him about this card here, I was like, dude, do you have any of the Ancient Origin, um, staff promos of the Gyarados to spare? Because I, I didn't get to make it and the staff promo just looks so brutal, like look at that Gyarados. And yeah, so I got a staff promo Ancient Origins Gyarados. And he gave me, not one, this one's just the normal, but he gave me two, <laughs> three, and four four of them so that was crazy I was like dude do you want anything for that and he's like nah don't worry about it don't worry about it I'm like oh man oh man and this is so this is a, a nice like HD look at the chosen what promo which looks awesome and I got a little pink sleeve that I found on the ground so that's interesting as well <laughs> And then, so, um, I actually, one of the guys there is making a Tyranitar deck, so he, he wanted the regular Tyranitar EX, and I traded that for this White Curum from Plasma Storm, which is pretty cool. And then, um, the judge also, he's a collector of Meloetta Full Arts from Legendary Treasures, so, he was like, uh, would you like the Groudon, a Groudon Full Art for the, um, Meloetta? I'm like, dude, I want a Groudon Full Art. So yeah, he hooked me up. He was like, yeah, because I needed this for my Primal Clash set. So that's amazing. That was awesome. And then to the pulls of my actual box, let's just go through these again. We got the Octillery Hollow. So this is pretty playable. With the um, ability Abyssal Hand, it says, once during your turn, before you attack, you may draw cards until you have five cards in your hand. So if you have a pretty heavy turn where you use a lot of cards, a lot of um, supporters, and your hand's getting low, um, in your previous turn, you get this sucker out, use the ability, and you can just get a nice refresh of your hand, so that ability is very handy. Very handy. And then we got the Typhlosion, so this card is just pure, pure power. So it's got massive eruption, so that's one energy. It does 80 damage straight up. Um, initially you have to discard 5 cards off the top of your deck, but then it does 80 extra damage for every single energy that you discard in out of those five cards so that's yeah that's pretty heavy heavy damage you imagine if you just happen to discard five energy five times 80 uh, you do the math I'll say like 400 damage see you later but yeah so that card's pretty sweet that's an awesome holo and then we got the Florgus Florgus or Florgus break which is awesome so break evolution so what's that say uh, Flugus Break uh, retains the attack abilities and weakness, resistance and retreat cost of his previous evolution. So obviously you'd play it over the Flugus, regular Flugus, 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 Flugus. I'll try and find it because I got all these cards. Like these are all breakthrough cards.
So let's get those off to the side. Okay, so you get your, your regular Florgus. So this is the one from um, Breakthrough. Has Wonder Shine. And Karma Aroma. Calming Aroma. Each of your Pokemon attacks cost one less energy. Okay. I, I didn't really get to read the uh, abilities very often. But anyway, it sits like that. That's all it is. So, it, yeah. It's pretty sweet. I'll probably speed up through that... Uh, that sorting section to find that out. But yeah, so we got the Florius break, so that's awesome. It's not the best break we could have got, but it's still awesome to see the card in person. And then the final pull we have to show off is the Giovanni scheme. So if you let's see if we can get like a nice look at that texture. Looks pretty spiffy. So let's have a close up of this. It says choose one of these abilities. So you can draw cards until you have five in your hand. It's nice. It's just like a draw five cards. Not a draw four like an Uno. Draw five. But anyway. Or during this turn, your Pokemon's attacks do 20 more damage to your opponent's active Pokemon. So yeah, that's pretty um, pretty decent. Giving you a choice to be offensive or to be strategic, if you know what I mean. So that's interesting. Very interesting. Either way, so yeah, I had a bit of a day. It was awesome. I got got some nice little additions to the set. The turnout wasn't crazy, crazy, crazy um, to the pre-release. I think there was about oh, 10 people, 10 people total uh, that rocked up, which would be nothing like it would be in America. But yeah, so it was, it was interesting, interesting. I'd like to see how it is if I went into the city and uh, sussed that out. But either way... Uh, I'm going to stop that camera. Done with that. Uh, but if you guys enjoyed enjoyed watching me go to the pre-release, I, I enjoyed it. I had such a good day. It was my first time. Got to meet some new people and open some packs of the set that's not released yet. Look at, look at all these packs. Look at them all. Look at them all. Either way, uh, like the video if you enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in my next opening. Peace.